Make tea, not war. Today we're going to talk about crafting. Now, there are several ways to craft. There is crafting the stuff you get from these camps, which is this. But I'm going to be focused on the stuff you get from these mines or from adventures. Now, which one do you choose? For example, we click on here. I've tried it both ways. Today, even. And I will show you which which one is better for crafting specifically to get gear to craft because there's many pitfalls. Click on our email. We'll start to see just a small sample of uh, how much I uh, got from each mine. One little piece of gear. Ooh, got a purple piece of gear. Couple pieces of gear. Um, couple more. Couple. Basically, I got crap. I mean, you get these shard things or whatever. That's good for, you know, this, this section here, the district enhancements. Um, even though that, after a while, doesn't even do anything. But, literally, the only way. to get gear fast is you're going to have to spend gold and by this you're going to have to do adventures you will see to get um, better uh, you know rewards uh, you would uh, want to send your uh, cat your stupid alley cat to the uh, tavern but for the most part, you're going to be going for uh, the uh, small amounts. Because you don't want to sit there and spend all your gold. But sometimes you don't have a choice. So you have to do this cobble tunnel syndrome for hours. If you really want to get some gear. Because you're going to find out you're going to run out of gear very quickly in this game. And I'll show you a little later. Provided my microphone doesn't cut out, it always cuts out. So you're going to have to keep on doing this over and over. Sometimes you don't get gear. But you see how much faster it is. Because time is a, time is not your friend. Uh, like I said, I generally select the things that are under five minutes. So I don't have to waste... Uh, 95 gold because the the idea is to get the gear I don't care about right now you know making RSS so I try to get things that are under five minutes and under under um, two minutes even so I only spend 14 or 20 gold as you see I have no gold <laughs> so if you go to the crafting and I would try to focus on one thing you see I've focused on two things and it's sometimes kind of productive but you're gonna see you're just gonna run out of the most basic thing I was able to craft right there but now you start here and you're gonna see after a while I've been collecting a bit this particular piece of gear that I'm trying to get is very expensive it's a waste of time really well you will see after a while I will run out I have no idea when and this thing's always screwy when you're trying to do this thing traveler's gauntlet is something that I often can't craft after a while. I 
I'm going to be able to do it here. This game is so screwy. You have to like start over again. Like you see what it's like. <laughs> so many flaws in this game. It's Russian dolls is what it is. That, that's the whole concept. And everything's a pitfall. Because what happens... This is, so, this is all messed up. You have to go st back out. This game is all messed up. Always messed up. Now it wants me to craft another. Oh, I have to craft another. You see this... This this uh this glove is just it never stops. You just need it over and over. And it looks like I'm right at that point. Right there. Can't can't craft it. Cannot get this little piece of gear. Now if you back out of here, go to reforge. Especially when you're doing the uh, when you're doing the uh, the red stuff, when you're uh, reforging the red stuff, you oftentimes go to this section, the common section, and just use all these things up. Just go find something that has 99 or something, and just you know use it all up. And then you find you can't craft those other things. It's always going to be counterproductive, always. Now the gear that I need, oftentimes I'll go to this section. It helps to remember what you need to craft that thing. So you don't reforge things that you need. I got purple gear right there. But I didn't get good purple gear or the purple gear I need. As you see, I hardly have any uh, any items. All my items are gone. I've crafted them all. Well, I got some of these because I hit a bunch of camps yesterday. I think I need that thing. There's so many different ga uh, ga uh, items. How can you remember them? And basically, you got to do this over and over. But, like I said, in order to craft, you want to craft uh, something like this. And the only reason I'd be crafting this is because this is the fastest gather, not gathering speed, uh, march speed that I can craft. And some people in the game have, I don't know what, what gear they have. We could go and look. Um... Mod speed. This thing, I think you would need to um, buy some packs. I believe this is like pack stuff. I'm not sure. This a lot of stuff. But this thing. What's the problem with this thing? Path to glory. I didn't complete. <laughs> I cannot get that gear. So I can't craft this. And that's the dilemma. The only thing I can craft is like this one, 85%. This would be a compromise, right? Ooh, look at all this stuff. This is all like Imperial Games. I'm not too good at that. I don't even know how to do Imperial Games. So I'm stuck with the crap I can craft here. And it gets slower and slower. Here's another one. I can craft this. But Postman's Boots. Postman's Boots. Uh, did they have Postman in uh, medieval times? Messenger Boots maybe? See I can't craft that. I could potentially craft another one of these. But I need another one of these. I need two more of these. Um, as my, if I'm going by mod speed, when I attack camps, 
Um, those are my fastest gears. That's all I got. I don't have anything faster. I could level this one up. I don't know if that crafts anymore. But if you want to craft, you have to uh, do adventures. Simple as that.